I'm James Cindy. I'm 24. Last year I did magnet letters. This year I'm doing magnet words. They're both based off of sets that people have for their refrigerators. I like this one a little bit better because it's a little bit more refined from last year. I like stuff that people can, it's hands on. All my stuff is something that people can use and touch and feel and interact with. I do stuff that people can kind of have fun with, feel like they're part of like the actual project. If it's as well accepted this year as last year, I'd love to do something like this again. I'm already thinking about new ideas that would be possible for that plaza. It's the center of downtown and it should be used more. Those spaces, they're, they're so, I mean, I work downtown and I walk past them and they're so dark and dismal. It, I think SpaceWorks does an amazing thing for spaces downtown. It, it just brings something for people downtown to, to look at as opposed to just keeping their eye on the cement sidewalk. You know, I've always been interested in art, but it's been, you know, playing around in the living room or the garage or something like that. I did a project in college and I did a quote um, and glued it up on the wall down at UW Tacoma. And I had that project, it was, you know, letters about a foot high, foot wide basically. And I brought it home after I, finished installing it and taking it down and I had it in my apartment and I would have people over and it was kind of funny to watch people would play with it and make different sayings with it and then I thought about that on a large scale and actually a professor of mine told me about a Spaceworks um, stuff coming up and I thought about that on the plaza where you could line them up on the steps like that. I wrote a proposal for letters, I had no idea that I would even get that okay by the city, so it was exciting and overwhelming. I didn't even think about all the work it was gonna take. I had to scramble to get together thousands of letters. I got excited and then I got overwhelmed and then I got excited again after the installation. And it, was, it's, it was a roller coaster, kind of, for a month there. It turned out to be way better than in I even imagined. In my head, I thought that that pile of letters would be a pile for probably the whole month. And it might have, must have been a half hour and that whole four or five thousand letters was all, all gone. It was all on the steps or on the ground making designs and I couldn't believe it. I, I could, you know, it was, just, it was amazing to me. There was kids walking on the pile to find their O or their A or their T. It's kind of crazy because I, I love art, but I never thought that I'd actually be able to show my art in public, per se. You know, I, it was more of like, if you come over to my house, yeah, I painted that, I, I built that. And if last year's project didn't happen, I would be doing that. It basically changed my life. It's kind of fun. Without Spaceworks, I don't know if there would be too much of an art community. I think it brings a really new crowd, a real new spice. It brings new art to Tacoma. It allows for emerging artists like myself, that might not even emerge, to be artists. I think it's an amazing program and I'm proud to be a part of it.